Grace and peace be unto you from God the Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kings and queens, and those around the world, welcome to Royal Generation Body Christ Believers International Incorporated. This is yours truly, presiding bishop and chief apostle and Dr. Lamont Robinson, founder, along with our first presiding prelate, Apostle and Dr. Paul Smith, our general mother, Dr. Penera Burns. Please tag and tag about the family and a friend as we experience the supernatural power of the Lord. Good morning, Jesus, and to you all. Wherever you watch this from your living room, your dining room, your kitchen, your bedroom, whatever destination that you are in, amen. Roll your generation worldwide at gmail.com. Monday through Friday from 6 a.m. to 5 p.m. are business hours. Amen. You can call for prayer or you can text on the comment section 914 512 8581. Amen. It is open to you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We're praying for miracles, signs and wonders, breakthroughs, deliverance and healing be amongst each one of your lives. It's the year of breakthroughs, signs and wonders. We destroy the powers of darkness, demonic forces, demons and devils, witches, warlocks, witchcraft, sickness, disease, amen, ailments, Amen. We decree the healing power of the Lord to rest upon you right now in the name of Jesus. Isaiah 54 and 17 says that no weapon that's formed against you shall be able to prosper. Amen. Give him the praise. Give him the worship. Praise in Almighty God. Amen. Healing is in the atmosphere. God is shifting the atmosphere wherever you are. We esteem and honor all the apostles and prophets, pastors and teachers, evangelists, to every denomination from every faith. Amen. God wants us as a people to come together and unite. Whatever, whatever reformation you are part of, God wants us to come together and be at one. Time out for all me, myself, and I, it's time for us to come together as a people. Because when the God of us come together and we come in one accord, something begins to happen. And when things begin to move and shift, amen, in the atmosphere. And we thank you, Lord, for your presence. Just reverence the presence of God. Amen. And we sent forth the angels from the third heaven. We sent forth the angels from the third heaven. And we destroyed the powers of the enemy. We destroy every plot. We come against every altar. We come against every altar. We come against every altar. In the name of Jesus. We ask your God to supernaturally move. Amen. Break the prison bars. Captivity be broken. J yokes be destroyed. Confusion. We rebuke you in the name of Jesus. We come against poverty. Man. Trying to figure out how I'm going to pay my bills and rent. And I'm going through some foreclosure notes. Amen. Trying to figure out how I'm going to pay these bills. Back and forth in the shelter system back and forth on the streets, hustling, doing different things. God knows all things. Homelessness, sleeping in from this house to that house. God knows all things. And he's getting ready to move in your life. Through your struggle, God is going to use you. And he's going to bring you out. Reaping me in door for a night. But joy cometh in the morning. God is getting ready to supernaturally move 
in a whirlwind upon your life. Don't come down, come up. Addictions, sexual addictions, drug addictions. Dealing them, you're dealing with migraine headaches, schizophrenic, mental illness, depression, suicide, low self-esteem. Amen. Depression. Depression. Amen. Asthma. Asthma. Have a trouble with breathing. Asthma pumps. God is healing you as we speak. High blood pressure. Gouch. Amen. Marriage couples issues. Divorces. Relationship issues. Whatever you're dealing with, put it in the comment section. We're going to pray for deliverance. We're going to pray for restoration. We're praying for the peace of God. And we come against every untimely death. We come against suicide. We come against the bullets. To gun. We come against a man home invasions. And may we come against the rapist, the molester. And we rebuke in the name of she that rapist spirit. That rapist, rapist spirit. Amen. A rapist, molestation spirit, molestation spirit. We come against that spirit in the name of Jesus. Amen. The predator. The predator. The predator. The predator. He comes to hinder. Amen. We come against that spirit. Molestation. We come against that spirit. Amen. You do anything. We bind that spirit up in the name of Jesus. Protect our young people as they go back and forth to school. Whatever destination that they're part of, protect them from the reapers. Protect them from the doctor. From strange strangers. Protect them. Amen. Nightmares. Some of you get nightmares. Masturbation. Pornography. They come against every spirit. It's not like God. Amen. God wants us to live holiness lives from the pulpit to the door and from everyone. Jesus Christ is soon to come. And God is supernaturally moving around the world. Every sanctuary. Around the world, God is getting ready to supernaturally move in your lives. So to be saved, and by the millions, by the thousands, people are giving their lives to Christ. There's a great revival to get ready to happen. Amen. God is exposing, amen, and revealing people what they truly are the false doctrine, the false apostles and prophets that are building things in their, in their own thing and it is not God Amen people are running the streets Amen protect, protect, protect Amen, protect Jesus is coming back people. Jesus is coming the Lord is getting ready to move God is marching in. He's marching in. Amen. That's like he said he would in Acts chapter 2, verse 16. He spoke about a prophet, Joel, that I pour out my spirit amongst all flesh. Like your sons of Joel, that you prophesy that he done mighty wonders and miracles in these last days. God said, I am God. Amen. I am never changed. I'm the same yesterday and forever. And I'm getting ready to walk in. I'm getting ready to move. Glory to Jesus. Glory to God. Reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence of God. No more services like usual. No more services like usual. Reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence. Reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence of God. 
reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence of the Lord. God said, I'm walking in. I'm getting ready to supernaturally move. And man, people are coming up wheelchairs. And man, people are coming being raised from the dead. Luke chapter 10, verse 19 said, Behold, I give unto you power. Tread over serpents and scorpions over the powers of the enemy. In Ephesians 6, mm-hmm. amen, verse 11, 12, and 13 to 14. Finally, my brother, and be strong in the Lord and the power of his might and put on the whole armor. Not half of the armor, but the whole armor. But he gave me the, because God wants you to be the repair, but you go on the battlefield. Amen. When these demons come in like a, like a royal lion, God gives you power to slay them demons. Remember the power that lies in your mouth. You got the power to tear out every demon, every snake. Some of you got snakes around you. Some of you got hidden snakes and warlocks around you. And everything is going to come out to the limelight. Amen. Leaders of God are going to be exposed. Truly what they truly are. Whoa, but she called me Matthew chapter 7. Matthew chapter 7. Amen. Verse 15. Amen. Beware of the war, but sheep clothing. God is getting ready to expose people from the pulpit to the door. Eyes have not seen, ears have not heard the things that God has in store for you people. Amen. We can get that spirit of unforgiveness, rage. Mm. Amen. Some people are trying to pray against you, pray sickness against you, but we, we reverse every curse. We reverse it. We reverse it. Psalms 27, Psalms 91, Psalms 124. Do the persecutions, do the trials, do the tribulations, do the storm. Give him the praise. Give him the worship. God is with you. Don't give up. Keep moving forward. Because I'm going to do something great in your life. And I'm doing some mighty miracles in your life. We speak jobs. We speak jobs. We speak increase. We speak healing, deliverance. We speak that the outpouring of God is supernatural. What happened in your life and we give you the glory God we give you the honor and we give you the praise come up come against we come against that religious religious spirit the spirit of, of, of competition of mimicking people of the Lord God make you an original you ain't got a copyright or mimic anybody I know you admire these people for God made you who truly what you are. You are a king. You are a queen. You are a warrior. You ain't got to copyright nobody else but be you. You ain't got to copyright nobody else but be you. Amen. It's time to put on your war clothes on. And be warned for those that are dealing with. Amen. Rebelling and disobedient people, children, become with that spirit of gang violence. Amen. Things are going on right now as we speak. And the Lord is getting ready to march in. The Lord is getting ready to move people of the Lord. No more services like usual. No more services like usual. No more. Come and get the spirit of greediness, spirit of pride, ego, arrogance, traitors, amen, false accusers. We come against that spirit of manipulation, blackmail. Mm-hmm. Everything is going to be done in the dark, dark, or the to the light. Whatever is done in the wash. God himself will bring it out to the rinse. 
God is going to reveal people what they truly are. Some of us is holding on to hurt as we speak. Things we've been going through. Been give, we are givers. The selfishness, spirit, spirit of hurt, a, a fatherless, fatherless hurt. Some of us have grew up in foster care, grew up without single parents home. We grew up having had all the toys you want, having had all the attention that you want. And we have been, amen, going through a lot of situations. And God is supernaturally getting ready to move. God is supernaturally getting ready to move. You've been going back and forth through the, through the system. Through the system of trying to find a housing. Because you got a, a family. Baby mama drama. Back and forth to court. To court. To court. Child support. You've been going through a lot of situations. And man, the fear of death. And man, you don't trust people. I know it. You don't feel sometimes. Some things around you give you familiar flashbacks. Because you have lack in them areas. It's called love. The love has waxed cold in your in your past. So you're very funny on embracing certain people, amen, moving forward. The love had waxed cold. The understanding, the wisdom of hearing me out, amen, the lack of support, amen, in your past. All the places that you wanted to go. You wanted to go different places. Haven't had lack of money. You've been taken advantage of. You've been a slave to your parents. You've been a slave to your, your mom and your dad. And you ever had to fully be a man or fully be a woman. You're living your life through people. God wants you to live your life. God wants you to live your life. Some of your parents was... Uh, I was born in prison. Let me tell you my testimony, the people of the Lord. My mother did 30 years behind prison. And I was born in prison. They had a first last name. And she, and she was in there for like for 30 years. 25 years. Had me in prison. Then from the prison, then I was in foster care. Then from foster care, I was adopted. And I could tell you some stories about my testimony and how God has blessed me. Yeah, Amen. Um, uh, I used to go, we used to go up there to my brother's uh, foster care mother to go see my mother in Mef uh, my Kisco Correctional Facility. See my mother after the Lord after the Lord took her home nine months later. The Lord took her home to glory. It was crazy, man, but God spared my life. He spared me through a lot of things. Try to join games, try to do a lot of different things. Did unseemly things. People of the Lord, some of you right now are battling with bisexual, homosexual, straight, whatever you are. God loves you. And he got great things in store for you. God is the one to judge you. Our job is to preach the gospel of Christ. And God's job is to clean the fish. God's job is, is to take you to another level. And man, you got great gifts. Stop with all this judgmental spirit. And preach the love and the compassion and the power of God. Because God is supernaturally getting ready to move. So I'm talking to everybody that don't tell people about your secret struggle. And God is getting ready to move in your life. Romans chapter 3, verse 23 says, All have sinned. Not consider homosexuals, the bisexuals, or 
heterosexual or whatever. It's for everybody. Gossiping. There's a lot of sins in that bucket. But God died on the cross for your sins. And you have been forgiven. It's time to come back home. To your first love in Jesus Christ. It's time to come back home to your first love. And that's Jesus Christ. He said, come back home, my sons and daughters. Come back home. Come back home, come back home, come back home. Amen. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Mr. Thompson, God bless you. We worship you, God. We honor your presence. Brother Shelton, God bless you. Amen. We worship your presence. We honor your presence. Worship the Lord. Worship the King of Kings. Lord of Lords. God is saying, get you ready to move in a revival. Amen. People are going to be miraculously healed. Delivered. Set free. We worship you, Lord. Honor the presence of God. Reverence 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 the presence of God. He's in the place. Healing, deliverance. Reverence the presence of God. 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 I'm keep saying it until it hits your spirit. We worship in God. We are honoring His name. I know it's Sunday, but we reverence Him. We honor in God. We put in too much honor in man. I know this is the bishops and the apostles, but we reverence the Lord. We worship God. Enter into the presence of God. Reverence Him. Yahweh, He's God. He's on the presence. Reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence of God. Wheel in the oh Come on, speaking a heavy language. Oh bokusha na mana kushika. Mana ma kushaba. Oh shata bokushiti because come on speaking a heavy language. Come on, come on, come on, reverence him. Reverence the Lord and Nanabo Kama. Strength, strength, strength. Oh, God. Reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence of God. Uh. Reverence the presence of God. Uh. Reverence the presence of God. Uh. We give you glory. We give you honor. We praise you. You are here moving in this place. We worship you. We worship you. We worship you, God. Uh. 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 You are getting good to us. Uh. You have been too good to us that we begin to ourselves. Uh. We reverence your presence. Your presence in this place. We're all about the Lord. We're all about Jesus. We reverence the presence of God. We don't come for nothing else but to reverence you. You have been good to us. 
do some head-on collisions. God has spared some of your lives. Amen. Through the storm. Through the rain. He has spared your lives. Some of you have had car accidents. Has survived strokes. Heart attacks. Amen. God has spared your life. Some of you go face an eviction notice, but God has spared your life. Give him the praise. Do everything that you're going through. Worship the Lord. Praise the Lord. Honor him. Reverence God. Worship the Lord. We come to adore Him. We come to worship Him. We come to lift His name up. We come to give Him the glory. All in us, all is to worship. All to Lord, to God, to God, to God, to God, to God. Him glory, majesty. Holy One, Holy One, we reverence the Lord, Yoshima, Holy One, Holy One, you're gonna put my true boy, you're gonna be worship, be worship, the rest of the book of Shabbat, I'm gonna worship, 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 your presence Reverence God I feel good people No more stress No more strain We thank you Lord For the refreshing We thank you Lord For the refreshing We give you the glory Give you the praise. We give you the glory. We give you the praise. Worship the Lord. 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 Reverence the presence of God. Reverence the presence of God. Prince of Peace, Yahweh, Provider. God has been good to us. Love you, Lord. people of the Lord I'm about to give it a tune out at six o'clock amen you enjoy the Lord's day give him the praise give him the worship now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to forsake you faultless for his presence with exceeding and joy to the only wise God our Savior be glory majesty dominion and power now forever we speak miracles signs and wonders breakthrough deliverance and healing be amongst each one of your lives. And we see you all January 28th 
at 5 p.m. 112 06 Farmers Boulevard, St. Louis, New York. Apostle Ira is the speaker about a family and a friend. Amen. It is to experience the supernatural power of the Lord. More grace to you all. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. And God bless you.